Hello, this is R-I-C-K-Y, the Android guy. Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you a video on how to use voice search on a Galaxy Note 3. Now most people think, can a Galaxy actually do the same thing the iPhone can with Siri? And the answer is yes, it can easily actually. So what you're going to do is you're going to go into your app drawer, and then you're going to look for the Google icon. Once you tap that, you're going to be shown what this app can really do, and you're going to say, yes, I'm in. From here, you'll just see things that you've previously searched for. But what we're going to go to is now menu and then settings, because we want to get to our voice command. So we're going to hit voice, and then we're going to tap OK, Google. And from here, we're not going to say those words. And we're going to tap that and you'll be prompted to ask this from any screen. Now what this will allow you to do is from any screen be able to say these words. Okay Google, okay Google, okay Google. And you can even do it from the lock screen. Now what this means is you can prompt voice searches from anywhere. So I could be looking for a new app and suddenly think, okay Google, What's the population of Los Angeles? The population of greater Los Angeles area was 16.37 million in 2000. Or I could be making a calculation and say, okay, Google, set reminder. What's the reminder? Record a video in 10 minutes. Here's your reminder for today at 10.53 p.m. Do you want to set it? No. So you can do Reminder this. Reminder canceled. What other things you can do is make calls, get directions, text message people, set reminders as you saw, ask questions, schedule meetings, play music, set alarms, and even more voice commands. So this is what you can do with voice search on the Galaxy Note 3. Hopefully you did like this video. If you did, please give a like, thumbs up down below. Thank you for watching. This has been R-I-C-K-Y, the Android Guy.